I'm Joanne Litton, the Carroll County Extension Educator, here to show you an easy meal that you and your family can grill. And it can be tailored to everybody's taste. So what you need is a piece of aluminum foil, a meat, I chose hamburger for this evening, place the meat in the center, and then add vegetables. You will notice that the vegetables have been placed on cutting boards, which is what I use to cut them. You always make sure for food safety reasons to use a separate cutting board for vegetables than for meat. Add everything on and you're ready to wrap it up and put it on the grill. When you go to wrap, pull both sides together, fold down twice, and then fold in each end twice. This makes sure that the juices stay inside your foil package. Now you're ready for the grill and the next person to make their meal. When your grill is hot, you're ready to add your meals right on top of the charcoal. Close the lid to speed up cooking. And now you wait. Halfway through, you'll be ready to flip a so when your food is done cooking, you will want to check it with a meat thermometer. You always insert it into the thickest part of the meat in the middle of the hamburger, and hamburger should cook to 160 degrees. We are ready for supper. So simply take your meal, and you're ready to add it to a clean plate. that look yummy.